Hello. All right, cool. We're live. So I'll send this out. Alrighty, I believe I am good to go. We are here live. Oh wait, 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 wait. One sec, wait one sec. I know what we're doing. That is. having slight issues here at the moment. It might be resulting of my stream trying to be at 60 FPS. So let's just drop that back down to 30 so we don't mess it up. All right. All right, good. Now we're ready. Should all be good. We've got the Lava Monsters, as they are known formerly as Holden Gate Warriors Miners, and they are versed enough against Boats and Hold, which are Yachts and Thoughts, which i got to update on here. Oops, Yacht. And which, there we are, the Yachts and Thoughts. Oops, I forgot that. I'm dumb. Alright, so week one. First game of the regular season here. They're coming at you live. This is going to be one in the on Sphere. Both halves, nothing, anything. We need to worry about. On the red side, we have Curry, Ego, Sundown, and B.I.G.Money. Um, that's bringing up the Lava Monsters. And then we have, on the blue sides, Yachts and Thoughts, Tantru, Quibble, Hawaii, and Carmel Bays, which Carmel Bays is formerly known as Havmed. I believe he is also playing offense. I could be wrong. I'm not 100% sure. We will have to wait and see because I know Hawaii is a defender. And Tantru is offense. And Quibble is also defense. So, we're jumping into the game now. It's going to be a great game. as Just like the Majors game was. Uh, unless you consider Bogat throwing a great game. And here we are. Switched up the texture pack for the stream, as per request of Big Money. Looks pretty nice. Uh, sounds are on. Three, two, so let's get into this. Sundown looks to be AFK. But no, all right. So, um, surprisingly, Curry's on offense, which after last season playing defense would not be something you'd expect to see. Same with Big being on off. Are on defense. Um, actually, that's not as surprising, but he is still very good at offense. So either way, let's see how they can do. Sundown returning, Quibble after taking a season off, um, is coming back as well as Havmed, and then Tantru staying in major or er, minors instead of playing dropping down to NLTP. So Quibble with a bomb back. Hawaii and Quibble here going to his try and get the contain, but Hawaii just takes an odd angle in, allowing Sundown out past two, 
have Mad going to get the, the rush out for the contain for both him and Quibble. Quibble waiting on the pups. Curry's going to get the free pup right, which is a tag bro. Tantra, however, gets an undiffused rolling bomb from mid. Now, Tantra here should probably go and get a grab. Unfortunately, he uses his rolling bomb just to buy some space and time. Not the best um, there by Quibble to get the return, as they do have a tag bro in base, and the positioning, thanks to uh, the tag bro, allows for the cap. Taking a 1 0 lead, the lava monsters are up. Havmad could be out here. He is, he's past two. Blocks are set up. And Ego just nudging. Uh, to answer your question, Bali, um, Curry has been minors for a while. Sundown could not make majors minutes, which is why he's back in minors. And he's also switching to offense, which is, um, depending on who you ask, his weaker position. But we got power up fights coming up. Two rollings again, both mid and left. Big and Sundown getting him this time. And then a juke juice for Quibble, who should be able to get this defusal. Not quite. Uh, Sundown a free grab. Big's going to get the next grab with his rolling bomb as well. And, oh, he almost spikes himself, or gets himself double tapped. And Quibble with a great bomb snipe. Tantru's out past three here. If Quibble can get the block, uh, now Sundown with his uh, experience there, rushing out to get the return. Have Mad uses the bomb to get a grab off of Big. Sundown on the other side. If Sundown dies here, it could be a cap. However, Curry also gets in position, and Sundown is now out past three. Tantru makes a smart grab to stay alive. And Tantru juking Big. Not quite enough room, though. Sundown's still holding. He's going to get this right pup. It's a juke juice. If he can survive here, not quite. Quibble running into the spike, but Havman does have the tag, bro. He should be able to play good defense here. Um, oh, doesn't see the spawn there. Neither did I. That was unfortunate. And then a smart kiss there from Tantra to both teams get a reset. So far, it's an evenly, aside from the first cap, Game's been pretty even. Oh, six minutes left to play though, so I'll have to wait and see. I uh, I believe that uh, Curry and Sundown um, have a lot easier time getting out of base than Tantru and Hawaii have, or rather, have Mad and Tantru have, especially now with Hawaii playing. The OD, uh, he's been struggling a little. Curry with the power up gets a rolling bomb. Quibble with a tag bro should be here to get a grab, but Big's gonna probably have a good, good chance of staying. Oh, Ego with a nice snipe. This is a great block from Ego, and Big's there with the spontaneous brilliantly plays around Ego's block to get the return. Why with the anti gets the reset? Sundown not able to do to grab, however. Curry is here. Havman should rush in. Giving he let Curry have a lot of room there. Not the best. Uh, a good corner. And Hawaii just missing. Curry dancing around Hawaii and Havman there. Sundown hesitates and brilliant by Hawaii. Gets the return. We're coming up with the next round of power-ups. Five minutes left to play. Tantru makes a, a very uh, poorly timed bomb to enforces himself into a grab, allowing Ego to get position on Havmad. If Tantru... Ooh, Tantru could not wait. To, he ran into the spikes. Quibble defuses Sundown's rolling bomb and gets the return. Nice play there by Tantru and Quibble. They've got the contain. They still have it here. This is, shouldn't be a big yeah, issue. Ego pass two. Tantra's in position. Big, not really anywhere. Curry's got the black, but Hawaii cuts him off. Let's see how this goes. Quibble make the play around the bomb. Sundown back on the boost. Is he going to be caught out here? No, he's not. Curry just nudges Quibble out of the way. And the blocks are kind of there? Not quite. 
Quibble again, rushing on the offender. This is one of the things that have been catching Curry and Sundown, mainly Sundown out here, is his ability to not, he's too patient. Not force it in. Next round of pups. Curry needs to wait here. He's got a tag pro, and that's going to be another cap. Quibble also coming with a tag pro. Hawaii trying to stay alive. And Sundown has a rolling re. Undiffused past one. And a great bomb there by Tantru. Ooh, just another great play there by Ego as well. Great plays all around here. Tantru getting nudged by Hazmat with that bomb would have been good, but unfortunate timing. And a great bomb again by Tantru. Quibble gets the easy return on Curry there. And both teams are at a full reset. We have three minutes left in this first half. Tantru gets another grab. Sundown flashes, but, you know, snipe there from Ego. It's a 2v1 on the pup here on the left. Sundown's got position on the mid, but Tantru with the bombs allows for it. Big takes it rolling from left, undefused. And Curry has a juice. Big with the grab and Tantru with the grab. Hawaii just missing. Quibble with the bomb snipe. Just a bunch of action going on all around here. Can Tantru hit the snipe? Nope, Curry saw that. He's not going to get sniped like that. And why is being a little patient here? He should be a little more aggressive on that. I don't know if he's been paying attention to how aggressive Quibble has been, but he's always caught out. Cur uh, she's always caught out. Sundown and Curry, just like Tantru did with the bomb snipe back. Both teams back at another reset. We're going to see how the pups come up. Curry makes an ill-advised uh, grab there as pups are spawning. Sundown is not going to be able to get... Oh! I, I take that back. Hawaii spiking himself allows Sundown to get the tag pro. But big three of holding gauges spiked themselves there all at the same time. Really, really poor play right there. However... They do get the reset, but Sundown is going to be sitting there with nothing to do on offense. He's, what he's got left of this will not be useful. Oh, Tantru with another bomb. It would have worked, but he was late, and that allows another cap. And two flaccids, and Hawaii blocked out. This is going to be another easy cap for Sundown. A quick reset here. Tantru and Havman as the defense and offense switch positions. Curry looks to make a grab, and he's going to have some room here. Not going to be able to get out. Last round of power-ups. One minute left to play this half. Hawaii is past four, and Sundown's back in the base. He's going to end up... No, Big just takes the pup. Smart play there. And Curry also getting a uh, rolling bomb and Quibble with the juice. This should... If Quibble can get the chance to come off of Re here, be a, a lot more useful on chasing, just like Big Z's in it. Havmad smartly moves above the bomb instead of being bombing back or into the spikes, but Big with a huge block. Ego also blocking, but Quibble's OD is 10 times better. Let's see if Curry can outplay the team here. Uh, an interesting offensive D here from Tantru. It ends up working out. But it's not really going to do much for the team. As there's only 5 seconds left. Not much. Oh, Tantru boosting back. If Sundown had more time, he probably could cap. So, first half, 4-0. Going over to Holding Gate. As we move on to the second half, let's see how this is going. Also, I've got a new scoreboard. I don't have any of the uh, scores actually in there. Um, and I don't know what text I'm going to use for it, so let's go through this together, shall we? Let's use a different set of green. So they got four. Yeah, that text looks awful. Let's change that up. Oops. We'll 
just use the same one for... Oh, that's a pretty basic one. I like this. I change the color though. I don't like the color. Make it darker. Yeah, let's do that. Let's do this. And then I'm just going to add another one. Uh, I do not remember what the text was. I'm gonna have to look at that real quick. Consolacer. Sorry, this is, uh... What do you... I was going to have a stream this week, but I had a project, and I was going to set it up, uh, differently, and have a better intermission and stuff. But it's okay. We'll roll with what we got. This looks pretty good for the time being. This is game one, half one, just ending there. As we move on to game two, or game one, half two. Both teams look to be not making any... Oh, I am wrong about that. Hawaii is subbed out for dodge here. And Lei... Lays, uh, playing as Laser, is coming in for Curry, it looks like. Not sure that name changed there. We could... Seeing something. Oh, is my stream... Oh, it's upstream. We're back into the game. Here we are. Going into the second half, we have the Lava Monsters, Ego and Big back on defense with Lays and Sundown on offense. With Tantru and Havmed still on offense here for Yachts and Thoughts and Dodge and Quibble. Havmed is now out past three. Not a good flasted there for Sundown. Oh, and Havmed makes a great boost, but Lays is in position as well as Ego. See if Havman can make a nice. Oh, Tantru is should have stayed on OD there, or rather on uh, a better position for regram. Sundown with his anti did well. Flashes from both sides. Ego makes a grab. The spawn there for Havman pushes him into the spike. Let's see how Tantru and Ego. Oh, Tantru gets doubled up. And Ego's not going to even allow Tantra to get a free grab here. Great play, but Havmed does get a free free Juke Juice to get the easy return. Dodge and Quibble back on the reset. Uh, I feel like I should add in the Miners, or the, not the Miners, the uh, score after, but I'll end up doing that later. Sundown making another grab, dodge with the solo, Tantru making a grab here, and Ego with the solo, and again, who was, that was Sundown spawning on the boost, as we saw earlier with Havmed, just boosting into the spike. Havmed does have a bottom boost up, he's gonna juke out big, but puts himself in a bad position. However, Ego spiked himself when Sundown bombed, but big with the contain just does not allow Tantru to go anywhere, and Ego gets the return. Dodge and Quibble on the other side are doing just as well, holding everyone back. Big's bomb doesn't help, but it hurts, uh, actually, the tag for there killed two. I didn't even see that, but Quibble with her, her Juke Juice is able to get a reset, and Dodge eh, is going to be on flag with it, and Ego as well with the tag pro. Great play there from Quibble. Avman goes for the grab. He a uh, little hesitant. He had the point two five off, but then ran straight forward with his momentum. Um, not much he could really do, but we could try. On the other side, it looks like Lays and Sundown aren't really getting that many good grabs. The defense here is a lot more uh, is playing a lot better on the prevent side. 
on Quibble for Quibble and Dodge. And any grab they get. Oh, as I say, that Laze is out past two. He's going to walk it in. Not going to have the split. A grab from, uh, from Tantra there is, gets the boost back. And Quibble's getting a free tag, bro. Tantra, however, doesn't wait for the power up. Bombs up and allows Sundown to get it. And have mentioned bombs. Oh my goodness, that would have been a cat. <laughs> he just boosted into the spike. He was past four there. <laughs> Not sure what uh, happened there. We can call that lag if we uh, want to. But that was a uh, little advice. A good, a pretty good block there from Lays. Dodge and Quibble on the contain. Dodge misses the bomb, but he stays ahead with the boost. Contain back for both of them. Easy return there. Routine defense coming out from both sides here. However, the offense of Havman and Tantra need to step it up a bit. It seems uh, that their grabs are not really in going for handoffs much. It looks like they're just trying to solo grab and hope the other one can play off of it. Big gets another uh, up, gets another pup undefused. However, his spawn. Havman making the smart play to defuse it. However, the bomb bombs him back into a flaccid. Quibbles uh, with another juke juice is not going to allow anyone past mid here. Another easy solo there for Quibble. Ego on the boost blocks big, allowing Tantru out. Havman with the block. The blocks are here. Quibble's just got to get the solo. And Lay's grab just buys enough time. However, Quibble again on the hunt. The contain. It's just, it's a simple contain from Tantru with a timely bomb spawn. Putting himself in a weird position to bomb back. He could have stayed behind the bomb and bombed Sun down there. Don't agree with that play. But he seems, oh my Tantru. Tantra just bombing Havman to death there. Big is on the boost. Tantru and Big are... They're playing... Like, I don't know what you call that. Just trying to dodge him. And Ego's looking for the pup. Brings dodge straight to it. Smart play here from Ego would be to hand it off. Again, he spikes himself. I don't think that was intentional. Oh, and Quibble and both Quibble and Laze have rolling bombs here. Blaze defused, and Tantra again bombing another teammate. He's got to be a lot more careful with these bombs since he's killing everyone. Oh my goodness, Dodge with the great snipe. If Havmed could have gotten that snipe, that would have been the first cap. Again, the contain, however, is just on point for Yachts and Thoughts here. They just need their offense. Oh, and Dodge and Quibble just had a miscommunication there. Quibble thought Dodge was going to continue to block, and... He stopped. Oh, Tantru stopping for some reason. He had the cap there. And he runs into Lays. Another misplay there. That just another, he had the cap. Sundown bombing Dodge into the bomb. Or into the spike rather. Lays getting a uh, juke juice and should be an easy cap. Tantru just completely missed. Um which I don't that one's hard to hit, so I don't not much you really can do there. He's going to die most likely anyway from the tag bro. So it was worth going for it. And the tag bro here from Big. Not going to kill, but Sundown's boost blocks Tantru into the flag. And both teams end a reset. The defense here on Yachts and Thoughts has been really stepping it up. I think there's just been a lot of misplays. Um, I, I don't want to call Tantru out for being the only one to make misplays, but he's... Had a couple of bombs um, that have been less than ideal. Sundown just misses the boost. Quibble's got the block. And Dodge has the block as well, bringing this half back to uh, an even score. Power-ups are spawning. Tantru's got a free grab now. However, Ego gets a tag bro. Havmed will get nothing. Ego forces him out, and Sundown gets the return. Dodge's Juke Juice again gives an easy return. Havmed is going to be out past two. He's going to be out past three. The bomb here forces him forward. And Ego looking to try and sacrifice, but dodges Juke Juice. Just a misplay there again. They ran into each other. It was an easy play. They just got to tighten up what they're doing. They have it all. They have the plays. They're in control. They just need to be... Uh, <laughs> just need to stop misplaying. 
Sundown's grab gets him up as to the boost does spawn. Dodge has the bomb ahead, but just misses him. Sundown with a great stop. Dodge with a great bomb. Both playing that right. Just Dodge misses the actual flag. And Quibbles ro gets a rolling bomb that kills Dodge. Uh, Lays gets a, a rolling bomb from the side. And then Ego also gets a mid rolling bomb. So three rolling bombs. Not much is going to be had with them. Um, unless Ego can somehow get to the flag with it. Undiffuse and get a grab with it. Which it looks like he's going to. He doesn't even need it. Sundown just gets a grab off the play from Quibble and Quibble. I'm going to say he died there on purpose, but it doesn't look like it. And the timing. The, ta the rolling bomb ran out there, allowing Quibble and Dodge to get the reset. Quibble's got this return if she can just hold the contain. Smart play not to dive. As her, de her offense there lost the flag. Dodge getting back into position. He's got a perfect position. Oh, and he takes the boost just high off over Sundown. Sundown trying to juke him around. The power-ups have spawned. He is going to grab the juke juice as well. He th he's not going to be out. Contains too much. Big, Big made a mistake there with the bomb. However, Sundown spawn was there to save him. Quibble has a juke just- Oh, and Dodge just times that bomb perfectly. That is a great play. Lays bouncing off the corner, and Ego with the anti as he spawned gets the reset. That's going to be the game most likely here. I don't see another cap- Oh, and Lays jukes out Tantru. Ego needs to come out and block. Just misses, but that was a smart play from Lays to get the fake. The half will end here. It's going to end 2-1. to one. In favor of the Lava Monsters again, bringing the score to a total of 6-1 to one in favor of the Lava Monsters. That, that last half was definitely a lot better, as you can tell by the numbers. 16 uh, returns for dodge, as well as 3 minutes and 18 seconds of prevent, and 2 minutes and 50 for quibble. On the other side, just, just barely getting over 2 minutes for Ego, and 2.30 for... 238 for big. So that was game one, half two. So after game one, half two, the score was. Oops, that's not the right one. Was six to two in favor of the Lava Monsters. They take game one. Um, I guess the best way to add in a score here would be. Something like this. Uh, let's try this. We'll just add in a greater than or less. Is yeah, I think it's greater than in the middle. I don't know what to, what. There we are. That's not bad. So we have uh, the game one score there. Lava Monsters again take it. I think uh, the defense from Yachts and Thoughts was a lot better. It's possible that Havmed was lagging. He, he has left the group and disconnected from Mumble. Not sure. Oh, he has a fire alarm. My apologies. So, this could be bad. I'm not sure if they have um, what they would do in terms of a substitution. i really not sure if they would send dodge on O or keep dodge on D if Havmed is not there. So we're going to have to wait and see. For the time being, um, let's just go over, let me open up the tag for .eus. And we'll go over those. See where the data actually came from. So game one, of course, was the 4 nothing hap. 
two camps apiece for Sundown and Curry, and then uh, none for Yachts and Thoughts. Curry had uh, just over 2 minutes and 50 seconds of hold, and then Sundown had 2.02, whereas on the other side, the only person higher than a minute was Tantru with a minute 14, and then Havmet only at a, a near 40 seconds. If we compare that to numbers of game 2, uh, Havmet had a minute 27, and Tantru had a minute 18. Um, so, almost a full minute there, more for Havmed. The grabs also increased there for Tantru by 5, and then for Havmed, uh, by th uh, only 3. So, a lot more productivity from Havmed on that half. The big um, kicker, as I pointed out, was the the play, the defensive play from Quibble and Dodge, both with over almost three minutes. Uh, Quibble had 250 and Dodge had 318, whereas in the first half, Quibble only had a minute and 23 and Hawaii had a minute 42. Their contain was very well done as they, they just did, didn't, didn't let them out unless the first cap came from double tag pros where they had a bunch of different uh, uh, what do you call them? They have like really good play up until the last where they cap, like the last five ten seconds. So that's not too bad. The, they did the best they could. Uh, they had a play where they could have possibly gotten a, a return and saved it, but uh, timing wasn't there for Quibble and Tanju. It looks like we were probably gonna be waiting a bit here, and Quibble gave an update that he. Havmed has smelled something burning. In my experience with fire alarms, it's most likely that someone burnt popcorn. Quite often happened at my elementary school yeah, that they would burn popcorn at lunch. We, If we are taking a break, my laundry is done a minute 34 so we'll have to wait and see because if it is I'd just go ahead and grab my laundry and they do not know how long is Frothy playing this game? Uh, new uh, Lucky24 or uh, Snexter, he's not, this is not his team, he is already played, I believe. I don't know if their game has ended. Um, they they were playing a, against the small caps. I'm not sure how long that was, so they might still be playing, let me check for you. Um, yes, it looks like on Ball Don't Lie's stream, I got the link for you. It seems like they're just playing the second game. Uh. And the, oh, actually, um, the Aristocat, I'm not going to spoil it. You'll see the spoilers on their stream if you take it, or if you go to it. And they're currently in the game two. And it's about to end, so. Yeah, no problem. Speaking of which, um, I'm actually will go around the league then with the other games since we do have the time right before I go and grab my laundry. Uh, the Arista caps versus the small caps. Oh, spoiler alert! So if you're gonna stop, if you want to stop listening now and you don't want to be spoiled the scores, I'm gonna be going over it. The Arista caps versus the small caps. Arista caps took game one in an OT win. Um. 11 to 8. Game 2, the small caps had a, a grand lead of 6 0 in the first half, and they won 9 to 4 total on aggregate on rush. Let's head on over to the Degrees of Freedom versus the Meme Team Miners. Um, I would not be surprised to see Tyrus playing, um, rather, Ty playing, as he only played. Uh, 20 minutes, but I could see him not playing him as well. Game 1, 
uh, the meme team won seven to one, and currently the meme team are up, uh, I believe, ten to two, and the game two is just about to end. Forty seconds left there. We have, and then the Boost and Dynamo versus Orlando Roller Bears Miners. I'm not sure what their miners team name looks to have just ended, so I do not see the score, but I know. Boost and Dynamo won game one by two. So yeah, so currently we have a break um, in the action. Apologies for that. I will leave you with some copyright free music. Actually, yeah, let's get some and add in. Uh, You can see it there. All right, so. I'm back. I hope you enjoyed. That was Going Higher from Benzone.com. Currently still waiting. Hopefully that have met is good to go. Um, I do, however, have to say that I did miss out. There is another, uh, another game that I did miss, and that would be the Golden Caps, I believe is what their miner's name is, versus the Kitty Caps. 
or as D Star says, the little Sebastians. So let's see how that is. They are currently again, this is a spoiler. It'll only take a minute here. So cover your ears if you don't want to hear. They uh the Golden Caps won game one, six to four, and are currently Oh, it looks like they just finished game two. They, I believe, won. Yeah, they won nine to two. So the Golden Caps take it, nine to two. Good job there, guys. Um, how should we handle this halftime break, so to speak? We could add in our own pubs, but sixty FPS won't do that well. I wonder, can I do? I could do that. I could play some. Practice my Super Smash Brothers. That's really, really bad. That could be fun to do. Um, let's see if this works. Oh, let's see how this works. So I'll keep this open on my second monitor with the chat, letting them know what's up. But for the time being, let's just see how this works. Ah, oh, we'll get, get that out of the way. Yeah. Ah, uh, I'm not very good at this. And you're gonna see that. We do have a delay here, so I should actually add that on screen. Uh, let's see this. Delay. Let's make it an obnoxious color. I think that will stand out. Yeah, that works. That's embarrassing. I was asking how long can you wait? Um, I've got all night. So. Um, yeah, it looks like we're going to have a long delay here. Apologies for that. You can see the messages kind of pop up on the bottom. Echo, <laughs> alright, Echo's gonna watch me play. Oh. Yeah, so, bots aren't that good. 
Um, in terms of, what do you call it? Like, the recovery. It never uses its, uh, Fox never uses a side B. So. Oh, wait. Beam team in degrees of freedom went to a uh, OT. Ah, oh, here we go. I messed up there. I recommend checking out Rob's stream if you want to watch that. If you want to watch Tag Bro, because we're going to have a delay. Quibble's saying that some. Oh, yeah. Someone burned chicken in the microwave, so. Have meds back. Let's end this quick. All right. So let's get back to this. Alrighty. We are back and ready to roll. Burnt chicken and all. Going into game two, the map will be Rush. Have met is no longer Rip, so we are about to start game two. Um, actually, moment. Yeah, starting game two here. Rush is the map. Um, take it as you will. Uh, personally, got some bad uh, memories on it. With the against the holding gate squad. But, you know. That's what it is. All right, so we have, Three, two, if you remember, one. the same lineups. Uh, actually, that's not true. Sundown got out, and Curry's back in, so not too bad. And Lay's with a quick grab and quick out. He's got the team boost. The blocks are there, but Havman gets around it. Dodge gets the return, but with the Tantru contain snipes. Oh, but ends up spiking himself, just barely missing the corner there. Ego with a block, blocking Quibble in the spike, and Ego with another block. All he needs to do is block Havmat here, and Curry's got the cap. Great play. Very aggressive from Ego. Very well done. Plays out top, but boosts straight into the spike. Unfortunate. The first gr out for Tantru. Uh, as well as Yachts and Thoughts. Almost going into the spike. Dodge gets the block. Tantru, um, or not Tantru, rather. Quibble trying to get this pup, and Dodge will likely get the bottom. Yeah, he gets the juke juice. Big play in anti with the uh, tag bro. Boost there was an ill advised. Oh, and Dodge is making a fatal mistake. However, Quibble gets the return. A reset for Havmed. Havmed doing what Ego did. However, Lays doesn't fall out victim to it. He knows what happens. Ego! I don't know if that was intentional, but that was a great snipe there. 
I think he messed up trying to boost low and hit the wall and end up getting the snipe for a return. Dodge barely missing. Quibble on the tail. Dodge smartly plays anti as he lost his momentum. Great play there. Lays does get a grab. Just holds his momentum down to get out bot, buying time for Curry to get back to re. Um, the offense here for... Oh, and Lays splits Quibble and Dodge. I was going to say the offense for Tantrum and Havmet need to make some plays. Ego left, leaving Lays or Big on uh, D alone. Lays not getting anything. Tantru with the tag throw. Dodge, if the term, the timely return came, would have had a cap. Tantru hover grabs with the tag throw as he goes over the flag tile as it spawns. Um, when Dodge died, Ego on anti, not gonna get anything from it. Decides to come off and help Chase. Ch uh, Curry here. He's just juking around. Quibble taking the long way, but Curry cut back, buying more time for him to stay alive. But he does get killed. Big holds his angle on the inside, and then flaccids. Dodge could be out here with, it could be out here with a uh, head of two, just missing the boost. Big spawn did not help him. Blaze flaccids, and we're gonna have a reset. Power ups coming again in about five seconds. Um, Pops haven't really played a huge factor this game. Quibble going to cut back. Tag Pro for Curry. Juke Juice for Dodge. Just missing there. The return Tantra did. Uh, Ego going to just barely buy enough time uh, for himself. But Quibble's out. Kiss is a good kiss here. Brilliant play. Smart. Um, by both ends there to get the kiss and the resets. It was more of a uh, save here. Ego gets the grab and is not going to be out. He, he probably had the angle there on dodge just to beat him, but he, he plays it safer. Have med on the other side, and Tantru, again, with another anti. It, it looks to be this time working better. Have med, not sure what he's doing. They needed to boost away because Big had the angle on him. Dodge gets a grab. Out pass two. Two for a while. He's coming in. Have man waiting on the pup. The pup's there. He's late. But Curry's gonna get out, and Big has a tag, but Curry just boosts past Tantru, and that's a free cap. If you're gonna play OD, uh, it's hard to say where to position with the tag, bro, but if the tag bro's running into base, you're gonna get in the chokes. Can't be sitting out and about. Ego is out bottom. Now he's switching up top. Tantru could have gotten a free grab there. Lays was out of position. Not quite sure what happened there. Curry boosts straight into dodge. Great play there from dodge. Again, Quibble and dodge, uh, not as good as the last half. I think the uh, the wait, the time break might have taken the, their momentum they had, or it could be the map. It, I'm not sure. I'm not sure how they play both on this map. Um, have med. And Tantru do not look like they've missed the beat, though, with the break. And neither have uh, Big and Ego, as well as Lays. Curry getting a little bit warm back up, but he's doing well. Making the uh, educated plays, as they say. And Dodge gets a nice... Another contained by Dutch. And Tantra's out past four here. Quibble's got the block. And that's the first cap. Bringing it back four minutes left in this half. Four and a half minutes left. This is great change of momentum for the Yachts and Thoughts. Getting their pacing back. And getting back on track to get their first win and their first point this season. It's only week one, but you know. There's always a first. Uh, yeah, Havmed is... Uh, Caramel bays, but I'm not going to call them caramel bays because there's too many caramel, whatever. Speaking of which, he is out and he gets around Lays with the boost. Great play there. And then, oh my, Ego spikes himself. Big waiting on the power up. Tantru is going to wait smartly here. If uh, Hatman can get a tag pro, not quite. Ego with the rolling bomb. Tantru might rush it in. Oh, Tantru has this. Tantru, what a great play. He's showing that his misplays earlier were just the fluke. The, that was a great boost and a great juke to get around Ego for the cap. 
the Yachts and Thoughts bringing themselves back, playing like they belong, just proving what they know what to, they know what to do and how to play. Oh, and misplay there by Ego. That's another spike, I believe, for Ego. Smart on uh, Lays to get the reset. Tantru spawning right there doesn't quite get it. Dodge almost ahead. Um, this great Quibble's just beating out. And Dodge is out past three. The return here will cause a cap for uh, the Yachts and Thoughts, but Tantru smartly waits for the pup. Ego as well. Knew nothing was going to come of it, so getting the power up was better for both of them, as both use theirs for an advantage. Dodge could probably rush it in here. Oh, and Ego spikes himself again! Not sure what happened there, and the block from uh, Avmad, just great. Misplay by Ego for spiking himself. That's twice, I believe, or three times this half alone he's done that. Not sure if that's lag or not paying attention. But could have saved it. Habman not quite out. Tantru going for the block instead of getting the handoff. 50-50 play there. Didn't end up working in his favor though. This is currently half one of Rush. The score is 4-3 to three for Yachts and Thoughts. And great block there from Tantru. Havmed out. Dodge is waiting for the pup. Oh, and Havmed not patient at all. Wait, it tries to go for the split. Dodge and Tantru both picking up pups. Curry gets the boost spawn. Almost helped him, but uh, ended up hurting him with the, the juke just being right there. Tantru should go for the grab gear and try and kill Curry while he grabs. Close. Not quite the best play there. In that situation, um, flag carrier, if you can't get a free grab with for your flag carrier uh, and you have momentum running into the flag as the tag pro, you should run and try and kill one person while trying to grab because odds are you're going to get out with the point to five. Have men out here past two. Curry electing to stay back possibly could end up working from We'll have to see how Havmed plays it out. And Curry not. He's coming back to chase. We have a minute left. Tantru's not going to be able to get this top up again. Unless Lays makes a, an ill-advised decision. Oh, and Tantru makes a uh, misplay there. As he didn't take the boost out going over it. And Curry's able to tag him. Big with the juice. And Lays with the tag, bro. But Quibble with a great snipe. Saves the lead. Let's see how Ego's going to play this. Dodge just missing. Ego is out. He's Instead of switching out bot, he is out top now. So it ends up working for him. He's got 20 seconds left in this half. He should at least try and rush it and then give Blaze one more opportunity at it. But he doesn't take it. He boosts in this spike. Great play from Dodge there to rush out. Ego sniping Havmed and getting the return on, uh, on Tantra there. So we're going to end this half 4-3 to three in favor of Yachts and Thoughts. With a fantastic cap there from Tantru. Highlight of the game. Check it out. Uh, I don't have it marked, so he'll probably have it saved. So that would be... Oh, let's just make this... Uh at the moment so no one knows that they're so the game for yachts and thoughts they have the four to three lead this is game one or game two rather half one that just ended let's try this actually yeah let's try switching it to this We'll use this as like the, yeah, we'll see. I don't know how it will work. Right, I'm gonna tree this out again. Oops, that's not the right link.
I the half two is started, so let's get back into it. Is my sound working? Three. Oh yeah, it is. Two, okay. Sorry about that. Uh we have Sundown back in. Um the defense still has not yet to change Curry's boost. I'm not sure what Curry's doing here. He's waiting for the boost. I guess he's trying to not allow Quibble to know that he's going for it. Um pretty odd play there. Sundown's grub does allow him to get out, however. But big with the snipe. Oh, and this could be a cap. And Ego with the block. Quibble just not able to get there. She bounces off of Ego just barely over. Tying the game up. Curry's block allows Sundown to be out top. Pass two. Avmed coming out for OD. Doesn't quite get it. The whole team there. Cantry's going to get the return. Havmed staying near? You'd think he'd go for the return, but I guess he's going to wait for Quibble and uh, Dodge to do so. But uh, it doesn't look like anyone's aggressing. Not very smart here for that. Oh, and a Flaccid by Havman. Not a good time to Flaccid. However, Curry's waiting for the tag bro top. Well, he was waiting for the power-up, but it happened to be a tag bro. Quibble makes a great grab. She's going to die, but the handoff allows for the reset. But Ego, with the rolling bomb, is out bottom. They're playing anti. Tantru needs to stay alive here. He's doing so. He's just got to buy some more time. He's got the angle. Returns a cap, and that's going to be... Oh, if he gets the boost spawns on him. That was... Mm. He had it for a while there, but uh, Big did end up having the angle on him. He would have had it if he took it off the wall, but he didn't change his momentum. Obviously, that proves right there he is not using timers, everyone. Good on you, Tantru. Dodge makes a quick flaccid. Ahmed spikes himself, trying to defuse the boost. We're partially reset. Tantru and uh, Ahmed both kind of leaving there. Quibble's out. Not quite. Power up round number two coming up. Let's see how this goes. Curry sneaks in past Ahmed and Tantru gets the bottom juice. Let's see how this goes. Uh, Tantru flaccid is not going to allow Ahmed out. Curry's out. Quibble is ahead, and the blocks are there, and that's going to be a cap. Tantru, however, out past four with a great anti from Avmad. Again, game just tied up. Dodge, Flaccid need to get back. Not a bad idea. Oh, but Tantru allows the grab, and he's out pa and Curry's past three. Havmed OD perfectly. Perfect rush out. Tantru again on anti. He plays a lot of anti. And leaves a bit too early. She's got to focus on getting it and holding it. And waiting for his defense to be set up before he leaves. Just like there. Great job. Next round of power-ups coming up. Sundown's gonna try and hold Dodge off here. And Dodge gets the angle to get a tag bro. However, Big on the other side does as well. But he takes it out and again, Dodge hits the, the spike when he should have hit the corner. Unfortunate there. Oh, and Dodge! Dodge just juked Big out of the socks, allowing the save. That was great play there. Quibble's reset. However, Curry barely gets in position to take it away from him. We are still tied. As we go into the next part of this, the almost the next half, the last half, rather. Um... If we do end up with a tie, we will have a 10-minute OT, uh, five-minute split. Um, since it is no server, we are going to stay on the same one, on the same server, but just switch sides at five minutes. Next round of pups, we got a tag pro for caramel beans, or caramel beans, sorry, for have med. And a juke juice for sundown. Quibble gets the reset. Just gonna get the block. But Ego bouncing off Quibble allows for the return. Just denying the, the lead. Ego out bottom here. He is going to wait on it. Goes for the top. If he had the boost, it probably would have capped. But didn't have the angle. So almost. Curry gonna boost. Sees Tantru. I think that was also a little ill, uh, not ill, but um, messed up boost, rather. 
and he messed it up. Uh, Curry going to try and take it in. Ego tries for the block. Oh, Dodge spiking himself and Wibble out, but Bait can't really block two. Power ups are coming. This is a great time for Curry to hold as he does get the tag bro. He's gonna rush it in. Ego's block, however, allows just enough room. That was, uh, I'm not sure what was happening there on the OD, but it ends up working. And, uh, the, the Lava Monsters take a one cap lead with four minutes left. Dodge missing a snipe there. Curry out past two. He, he's got to juke out Tantra here, but Quibble just holds on his, holds her 45 and gets him. <laughs> Curry and Ego had the same idea, bombing it, boosting into each other, bumping balls. Uh, Ego looking, not quite sure what he's looking for. I guess he was trying to draw back Dodge. Both Dodge and Curry, they're missing the boost. Um, I really hope both of them plan for that, but I can tell you that they did not, just by the way their balls moved. It ended up working for Dodge, um, as he was able to get the reset, but... Curry's waiting on this pup. He gets a rolling bum. The juke juice from Big is not going to allow Tantra pass. But Big goes for the aggressive play. And he is out past two. Or, yeah, was two. With the flag carry. Not much going on. Tantra staying alive. Out beat the juke juice. Just running in circles here. Cur Ego, um, not deciding to play anti. Which, to me, based on how they were playing earlier, is very... um odd because they were playing that and they're ahead so even if they get the one cap lead they will still be ahead or they would be tied interesting kiss now they're looking to try and get it it ends up working but i don't know if that was the best possible play there we'll see if it pays off power up spawning top is really late tantra's gonna be waiting on that Havman does beat out sundown quibble not gonna stay smart play Tantru gets the the rolling bomb. He's going to go for read. Uh, uh, three chasers should be here. Uh, rolling defuse. Havmad looking to rush back. Probably should have gone and played anti instead of uh, chasing and having. But I didn't see the full play. I think they were trying, but not quite full. We'll be sure. Quibble does have anti-2 here for Tantra. He's puts himself in a pretty odd position. However, Big takes the angle uh, really well off that boost. Oh, and Tantra almost splits the D, the OD. Sundown playing anti. A great time there. As both teams are reset. Big possibly... Nope, Dodge reads him like a picture book. La second to last round of power-ups coming up. Tantry boosts straight into the uh, the defense. Not really much he could do there. Quibble and Dodge leave the pup. And Ego's going to be out here. Havman just needs to get around. And he does with this juke. If he did not have a juice there, that would have been a cap. Great play by Havman. And a great block by Big. Even though he, he didn't get the cap. Um, Interesting time to kiss. I th no one was really playing anti. So probably could have baited someone. Again, we'll have to see. Quibble in the great positioning. Just barely misses. Sundown gets the boost before. She... And Tantra gets the return. We are currently one minute left. The Yachts and Thoughts need one cap to take it to OT here. They have one minute to do so. They are not going to get the bottom pup. This a juke juice is pretty big. Have been looking to wait. Tantru playing smart, but by time here. Um, Curry looking for the pup. If Ego was in base, that would have been probably better, but ends up working out since they did get the return. And Sundown is out past two, possibly three here. No, he's out past three, but Ego might want to look to play an anti. Gets the return. Quibble just missing the boost, but dodge his angle. 20 seconds left here. Pass to Tantru coming to re for some reason. Quibble was ahead. And Quibble's coming back. What? That... Oh, golly. 
That was a, not a good play there. That is not going to be enough time to take the game back to a tie game. The Lava Monsters end up winning the last uh, cap, or the last play there that should have been more patient if they were going to go for it. Ends up taking it though. That will do it for game two on rush. That would be six to five total score. As the Yachts and Thoughts almost had their their first win there. Not quite though. Great games all together. The lava monsters end up sweeping. And uh, I don't know what to say. It could have been a, a it was a very close game. A little a couple mistakes Tantru with probably the cap of both games. But overall, the lava monsters were a lot uh a lot more consistent and they reigned supreme this week. I uh I'm not sure how to host someone, but I'm going to try this. If this works, you're going to be sent, you'll start seeing the, uh... Thank you, Jibs. This is a great scoreboard, I know. It's not my one I had intended, but, yeah, it is what it is. Um, let's see if we can get this. Let's see if we can do that. No? You. Oh, that's because there's no... Okay. Alright. Hosting. I'm out. See ya.